What's going on guys? This is Mustafa Love with Heartstorm Media. Thanks for tuning in again, but if this is your first time checking out the channel, you're mad late because I make videos like this all the time. But without further ado, let's get to the unboxing because Adidas decided to get back into the making, or really they've been making them. They got back into the selling Yeezy business, so me and Bay decided to get us a pair. And I'm going to be unboxing the Yeezy Boost 3 AZs in Kova. Let's go. The unboxing of the Yeezys is always super simple because it doesn't come with a lot of bells and whistles. They just give you a box with some sneakers in it. This is one of my favorite colors and you will be able to see what these look like on feet. For me, these are a size 10 in the Covell color and um, I was able to acquire these at auction and Pay was not able to get those in her size but she does have a pair coming. But in this box, like they don't really give you much or nothing with the Yeezys. You get some laces, you get your Yeezys, and that's it. Like it's not a lot of bells and whistles when dealing with ordering a pair of Yeezys. This is about as simple and generic as a, a shoe box can be like you know maybe they put all the money into paying kanye his portion of how much they got to pay him to get his cut off of these adidas so they, these are some of the most like uninspired unboxings i ever have to do but these are what they look like unboxed and you'll see what they look like on foot. Now I have to say, I've never been a huge fan myself of the Yeezy brand and I've always quite thought that maybe they were just a bunch of hype. But after test driving these Yeezys, I will say these are some of the most comfortable sneakers I've ever owned or worn. And I test drove them on the cobblestone streets of Savannah, Georgia. With all that being said, are they worth their price tag or what they're being sold for after market? That's up for you to decide, but I will give them three thumbs up for comfortability and fashion. Till the next review, I'm out.